Hey, welcome back to the channel. April 28th. It's raining. The weatherman was correct. It started raining. Uh, father and mother actually had to go to southern Michigan today to pick up some planter parts from John Deere. And I uh, said that rained the whole way down and the whole way back. So, and the weather's coming that from that direction. So, today, I'm going to start working again on this 900 LP. I'm uh, going to uh, replace that uh, manifold gaskets. That's not real hard. It's leaking on number one, um, at least. But I'm going to change them all while I got it apart. So, then, this is the tractor that uh, we changed the... Uh, you know the valves here uh, to control your uh, vapor and liquid anyways so they're fine but I got a new leak I don't know why I had the flashlight here somewhere but anyways I don't know if you can see it but I believe this is what they call a filter let me grab a light real quick here yeah that thing is leaking here I'll turn the air on or not air <laughs> the vapor I should say Of course now it doesn't want to leak oh of course now it's not leaking it was leaking yesterday right around there so we're turning that one on hmm. well, that's odd Yep, I swear to God, it was leaking right around there yesterday. Right around that, uh, that get like the gasket was bad or something. But I've got the line on full speed right now, and it's not leaking. So, huh, that problem fixed itself. Oh, I'll turn the gas back off. And we'll just work on the manifold. I'll take this hood off real quick and set her down and then I'll go to the other side here. I think that's all of them. Yep. Gotta take the muffler off. I already loosened the clamp. Well, I got this muffler off of, off of Amazon. I don't know, it looks cool and all, but the sound is just a little bit different. What's it say on there? U power. I don't know, it was pretty reasonable off Amazon. And I was like, well, for that price, I'll try it out. I think I'll put a little spray on there before we get too excited. Pretty sure these bolts haven't been off in a day or two. But, so, We'll get at that. I don't think, oh, I wonder if I should take this off. This is, um, yeah, that's the line that comes from the, over there. Yeah, they both come from, that looks a little wet there. Oh, I just sprayed that. That's why it's wet. Jeez, what a goober. 
I don't want to break any of those lines off. Because this one here is the coolant line. Because that one comes out of the, the water, uh, water jacket, water manifold. You know, this thing here. I don't know if I should take that off because I can get because the intake is gonna want to come down when we take all them bolts off. I think um I think I'll unhook the battery too. I think that might be a wise thing to do. Uh, let's see, that's the ground side. We'll do this one. You need to nail an LP, you don't need any sparks. Supposed to have a track meet tonight, but they canceled it on us. I don't know. I said because of the weather. I don't know, this would have been a nice day back when I was running. But be a little wet but I don't make that decision so there we go that's off yeah I think I'll start on hooking these this this line this line or will that actually help keep it up hmm now I'm debating so well, I can loosen them up, the the bolts up, and then we'll go from there. So, I'll just set you, set you down here. This Depth Star Three is handy. It's a handy tractor. Yeah, it's handy for a workbench. Oh, yeah, buddy. Here, I'll move you over here and then you can see a little bit differently. taking all these bolts out you probably don't want to watch that so and, uh, I'll turn it back on for when we're uh, when I just about take it off so how's that stand by I'm back I ended up not unhooking any of those lines I was kind of careful about it but 
Anyway, so we're, I think we're ready to take her off. Okay, well, looking at the manifold, I don't think there I need to do a whole lot to that. I'll clean up a little bit of rust, but it doesn't look like it's too rotted out anywhere. Now let's look at the heads. And that looks like it still has some of the gasket left over, but yep, there's the one that was leaking. Going tick, 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 if you can see that or not, but... Um, that gasket doesn't look too, too bad. Oh, that one's got some... That wasn't long for this world. So, I'll get them peeled off and get that all cleaned out. And we'll be back. Okay. Okay, I've got the new gaskets ready to go back on here. I just lightly cleaned up these services. Don't want to get too crazy. So she's ready to go back on already. See if I can do this without making too much of a mess here. That's sharp. Yep. Okay. There's that. There it was. Okay. I don't know how much this you can actually actually see, but it's pretty self-explanatory. See what I'm down down there. Here. Can you see much down there? If I do it this way, I don't know. Okay. Almost need another hand. Okay. You want to get closer, that's for sure. Mm, that was my finger. Oh, we. camera and do this. Jeez. Okay, there. Got that in there. Good lord, that was a lot of fun. Oh, I think I might have dingle buried myself here, though. That's got to go above that. Not that. Can I get in there? Rub it out. She come apart a lot easier and she's going back together.
struggle is real. <sighs> There, now you can watch me use my head. I think I got it started. Nope, I thought wrong. Mm. Come on. Patience, patience, patience. Don't get too excited. Oh, come on. Okay. I can see what I need to do, but I can't get in there to do what I'm supposed to do. Does that make any sense to you? You know what? I think I'll just wait for help. So, you won't have to wait very long, but I probably do. So, stand by. Well, it's the next day. Oh, I still don't have any help. I, I've been up since before 5 o'clock this morning, drank a whole bunch of coffee, watching YouTube videos of, you know, some guys that I follow too. But anyways, so, you know how it is sometimes when you uh, get away from some you know take a break or working on something and you come back to it and it goes you know go smoothly after that well i've got got the manifold just about on i've got a few a few more things to do there that helps so i gotta i gotta get some better lighting in my shop here but of course it is raining today again like they like they said i got a there's a local swap meet I wanted to go to today. Uh, it's kind of a smaller one. It's nothing like, uh, I think, the LeSueur, uh Minnesota swap meets this weekend. It's nothing like that. But uh, it's nice and close and handy. I got some other errands I can do while we're in town. But uh, um, side note, that tractor that I talked about, uh, you know, Equipment Facts called me the other day. It did sell yesterday. No, I didn't get it. Yes, I did bid on it, but anyways, it went for like 2700 bucks. It was a 1967 gas or super M670 diesel. Or, sorry, gas, not a diesel. If it would have been a diesel. That My story would have went a little differently, and I'd have had to ask forgiveness from the wife. But anyways, um, yeah, I went for 2700 I re-looked it up again. I did watch it, but, you know, like I say, I didn't buy it. That's okay. I'm not heartbroken. So I've got other other things I'm after that are more important. So anyways, we'll keep working on this. Uh, I'll get this button back up and uh, get the hood back on and start her back up. And we'll, I'll show you that. So you uh, probably don't want to see me just put every bolt on. So I'll, uh, I'll get that, like I say, I'll get that all done. We'll get it wrapped up uh, and fire it up and see if we can tell the difference okay it's all back nice and tight and on i'm to think about starting it up but then i noticed i have an oops i don't know if you can see back in there right there 
on the throttle shaft on the carb here. I guess next time, not a guess, hopefully I can save somebody else some trouble. Take your carburetor off. There's the intake manifold. Because apparently that can't support the weight of everything. So I'm going to have to find a new uh, new piece for this. This could go to your governor. So I'm going to see if i got an extra one around here. I've got some other LP tractors around here that may, may have that on there, hopefully. If not, hopefully I can find one. So in the meantime, I'm, I'll be right back. Well, I did a farmer fix. I don't have an extra one at the time. Uh, let's see if I can get the camera in there. But I use a zip tie for now. It moves freely. Still, I didn't make it super tight. I just don't want it to fall off for now. But I'll see if I can find one of them, order that from somewhere. I don't know if Dean Zine Gray will have that. I mean, this is an LP part, but I don't know if he has that or not for the carburetors. But we'll find out so i'll put the hood back on and fire it up oh like somebody's riding a motorcycle in the rain Missing a bolt. I was at an auction sale one time and I bought a whole bunch of these bolts. These are actually for a bend bolt, you know, for putting grain bends together. I got that rubber washer on there. I think I've seen somebody else use them before too, but kind of nice when you got, uh, you know, freshly painted sheet metal or whatever, that rubber seal doesn't scratch, um, you know, the metal. So I've been kind of, i got a whole bucket of them, so I keep them around for extras. You can take the washer off if you don't like it. I leave it on. Here's a good picture of the old gaskets. Yeah, I'd say that one was uh, used up. This one's had a few hours left, but uh, not that many. And this one was rotted right out too, so. Yeah, there was more than one leaking. So we'll, we'll send that to the scrap man. All right, I put this side on. Let me see, I just don't want. I gotta hook the battery up yet too. You're gonna remind me of that, would you? All right, hood's back on, muffler's back on. We'll turn the vapor on. Give her just a little throttle. Oh, I don't have the battery tightened up enough. Stand by. Okay, take two. Run and we 
smells like worms around here. This one inside, I guess. Now she's warmed up. Let's see how far we get her to idle down. Got that job done it's raining it's an outdoor swap meet so it's supposed to be held rain or shine there is some civilians maybe they'll have a have it inside a little bit so we'll go check that out i might take you along i don't know if i'm gonna video or anything or not but uh i guess hey thanks for watching please like and subscribe and we'll catch you in the next one